What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of What's at Mile High. Today we got a busy day at the shop. The first vehicle that we have is this Mercedes Maybach. This is an S580. This is in for a full remove and rewrap. The Only the lower half is wrapped in a satin black and then the top half is factory gloss black paint. We're gonna be removing the satin black and then actually rewrapping it in a satin black as well. Some of the vinyl is a little bit damaged so the customer just wants a fresh wrap on there. We're also gonna be doing a paint correction on the top half and then ceramic coating the full vehicle. So this is gonna be a fun little project. This vehicle is absolutely incredible. The luxury and the leg space in this car is just something that you don't see every day. So this is the key right here. Let's open this thing up for you guys, show you guys. You got the LEDs all around the vehicle. They're currently lit up in orange, diamond stitch seats. We got not one, but two digital screens. That one in the middle is almost as big as an iPad. Let me open up the back for you guys. The back is even more impressive. This is the ultimate luxury vehicle. Look at all this leg space you have. You got a TV screen right in front of you and you got the infotainment thing right here. This thing, I don't even know all the features this has in it, but just wanna show you guys this amazing looking car. So this is a second Maybach that we've had in the shop. The first one was belonged to Aaron Gordon of the Denver Nuggets. It was a two-tone wrap. We had the rose gold chrome on the top and then the satin black on the bottom. That one also had a fridge in the rear. It was just such an amazing vehicle. Um, something really nice that we got to work on here at the shop. Moving on, we have a couple other cars. To my right, we have this Chevy Tahoe. This is just getting some ceramic coating. This will be out of the shop by the end of the day. We also have a Jaguar F-Type over here. This one's gonna be getting some clear bra removal as well as some clear bra installation. We're gonna be removing the clear bra on the front end um, and then reapplying that clear bra. There's a little bit of damage on it um, right here. We got some, some spots right here, some damage right there. It's a little scratched and swirled up, so a customer just wants to refresh the clear bra on that. So we'll have this for the next couple of days, just working on that as well. We have another two vehicles in the shop getting some full window tint. We have Nate and Junior and Robert working on the window tint. Let's kind of walk around to the back, see what they're up to. So we got Junior over here working on it. Um, he's starting off with the back window. You want to talk about what this car is getting? Getting full tint, full 5%. We're going to black it out for sure. Getting smoke tail lights and reflectors. It's going to look nice when it's done. So we have this Toyota Avalon over here as well. This is getting some a full remove and retint. Robert's currently working on the back window. So what you guys heard, that noise is actually the power washer. We got Isaiah out here who's working on this Toyota Camry. This is going to be a full wrap. Right now he's just uh, doing a full decontamination bath. He's just cleaning up the wheels and tires. This is going to be going to a gloss lavender. We actually just finished up a Kia Stinger in that same color. Turned out really nice. We did a couple videos on it, posted on TikTok and Instagram. The videos on TikTok went viral. Um, so the people in the comments love the color. This is going the same one, that gloss halo lavender. So this one's gonna be looking really clean, really nice. And we'll show you guys the progress as we go along. Like I was mentioning earlier, we got this Toyota Avalon. It's in for a full remove and retint. Robert is currently back there working on the tint removal of the back window. Um, this one, I'm not sure exactly what it's getting, but it looks a little light. So I'm guessing the, the customer is gonna be going a little bit darker with the window tint. Follow me over here. We have this Jeep Wrangler that just dropped off today. The guys are currently working on the disassembly. This is gonna be getting a camo wrap. Uh, so a full printed design camo wrap. We're just removing the fender flares, uh, some of the pieces, some of the plastics here and there. When doing a printed wrap, you do have to lay the whole entire side all at once, just so that way the pattern all lines up and you don't have some misaligning pieces or anything like that. So what are you working on, Ahmed? What do you got going on? What are you doing? I'm currently making templates for the Jeep. Uh, yeah. What, what else you want me to tell you? Yeah, there's no completely. <laughs> It's a deep temple. So the guys are a little camera shy. They're still getting used to having a camera in their face, uh, but they'll get better as we kind of go along. We got Ariana over here. She's working on the Porsche mirror. Uh, you want to talk a little bit about how you're doing it? Man, I was going to say that. What? I was going to say I'm working on the Porsche mirror. Oh, yeah. Due to the complexity of the mirror, we do need to do it in five separate pieces that you guys can see. 
there's one piece in here on the side and then I have another piece around here I'm working on this current piece right here we're gonna have the fourth piece on the side and then the last piece is gonna be obviously that main stretch so progress on the Porsche Panamera is going really well uh, we just have a couple mirrors left and one quarter panel and then we just have to put the full vehicle back together uh, ceramic coat it and this thing will be ready to go we got Rudy over here underneath the rear bumper uh, working on taking that apart we'll leave him alone unless he just feels like speaking while he's under there looks like he's struggling a little bit <laughs> so we'll move on progress on the Porsche GT4 is going really good we're just about done with the door jams as you can see this thing is looking really good so far once the door jams are all complete we'll put the door back on get the rest of the body all wrapped up put everything back together and this thing will be ready to go we'll hopefully we'll have this vehicle done by thursday as well as the porsche panamera show you guys the finished product on both of those but that'll be it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to hit that subscribe button leave us a comment below let us know which vehicle you guys like the most and we'll see you guys next time on the final products